Okay, made it back to here. Good, you're finally here. This is definitely the work of the nearest key guardian. Clearing these shouldn't take too long. Thank you so much, the dual co engineer said it would take weeks to move these. Ugh. That's Portia's fault for sending him to the wrong location. She doesn't know how to do her job properly. Why would we send an engineer to fix this? What are they going to do here? Hit this with a wrench? We need to send someone with a bit more brute force, like me. I apologize, but my dual partner envelops everything nearby with darkness, so you won't be able to see for a little bit. Raygun, it's time. Okay. As it destroys the debris. And that's that. You can come back now. I've never heard of that doodle. How do you see in the darkness? These goggles I'm wearing let me see in the dark. That's probably why, because he's wearing goggles. What did you expect? I don't use him for ba I don't use Ray. Ray gone for bat in battles. Usually it's too strong for a normal tamer to fight. So it's probably like one of those like all powerful legendaries, if I'm guessing. Uh, being a duo co executive gives you a lot of nice perks, such as very powerful doodles, huh? Uh, Ray gone and I have had a special connection years before I've started working at duo co. Regardless, there's a lot of perks with being a duo co executive. Such as launching insubordinates out of a doodle, out of the doodle co cannon. That actually is a thing. Uh, that was a joke. There is no such thing as a doodle co cannon. Yeah, I mean there is such thing as the no. I nearly said it. If I say it, Manning is gonna put it on screen. But I know what I can say is, did yours or smash? <laughs> Because why not? I'm a very busy man, so I can't stay here for long. I can't stay for long. Wait a moment. Why is it so cloudy now? Is it going to rain? Oh, I forgot about that. My mistake, I suppose. Reagan can indeed be considered a sufficient threat to the local Key Guardian's territory. And it's raining. Is this all the power of this key guardian? Whoa! That made me flinch. That lightning bolt almost took you out. This is definitely the doing of the key guardian. No thunder. Oh, great. Electric. He's pretty weak. No! No, he's not. He said he... <coughs> As I was saying, uh, key guardians will continue their reign of the terror until they realize the threat is no longer there. Or their key has been subjugated. I personally can't participate in the key hunt, doodle co rules, and what not, so I'll leave stopping this to you two. The rest of my weeks will be a busy one. I have some vermin to hunt. Farewell. Are all doodle co employees this peculiar? He cleared the path for us, but something seems kind of off about that guy. We don't want these lightning bolts to hit a stray person, so we need to deal with this key guardian. I'll see you at Graphite Lodge. Yep, I'm going forwards. We're going into the next route. What's with everyone teleporting here? You're the person who refused to give Quincy your beginner doodle. This is an offense that I, Portia, the president of the Quincy fan club, cannot tolerate. Get hey, no! Why are you battling me already? It th I just walked through the gate! Squeed! Great, so... Oh. Okay, don't use electric on this thing. I will... use dark on you! Okay, use... Oh, okay. Get out of here. Oof. Okay.
Rain continues to fall. We got Borbeck. That's easy. Electrifying. Okay, so, you know what? Uh, where is it? I shall use a bandage! Uh. Excuse me. Thankfully, I used the bandage. And yeah, we'll go ahead and just get you out of here. Good night. <sighs> this is going to be interesting. All right, you leveled up. You leveled up. Uh, wants to learn crit up. Use a boost all allies crit chance for five turns. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, Glumish. Okay. Uh, oh. This isn't good, because none of my skills... Alright, you know what? Here. Enjoy being paralyzed. I guess I'll go do whatever I can with this. Alright. Okay, use plant sap. What does that do? Okay. Alright. Um. Let's go ahead and send in the Rose Coon. Okay, it does more damage. Gibble! Okay, just use the plant sap. It wasn't effective. Okay, so... It's a life-stealing move. Okay, everybody! Get out of here! You're not half bad! Let me reintroduce myself. I'm Portia, the Doodle Executive. However, I must prefer being known as the Quincy Fan Club President. The rest of the Doodle Code doesn't like me being the president of the Quincy Fan Club. Uh, Tennyson despises the Quincy Fan Club so much that he confiscated all of my doodles. If you didn't know, Quincy is the CEO's kit. The CEO is too busy to give Quincy any attention, so I started the Quincy Fan Club. Anyway, you've passed my test. I'll let you be friends with Quincy. He may be stubborn, but he's a good person. I gotta go, it's kinda hard to catch up to a private jet, even with my powers. Bye! And she teleported. Hey, I saw you three in the background! I know my editing's gonna zoom in at that point, because he loves doing that. Okay, um, so I don't think this will work. Yeah, I can't use bandages on a fainted doodle. Dang it, okay. I guess what we could do is we'll just let Rose Coon have some time in the sun and see how this goes. So what doodles are out here? There's two we already have and several different new ones. Okay, well, let's start climbing up in the... Right out loud. Just the first thing I step into. Oh, it's the wiglet. Of course, it's the wiglet. Okay. I shall nibble the wiglet! And rain continues to fall. I guess it's gonna continue raining until we resolve the. the key situation. Alright. Go ahead and toss that. No! Oh, okay. 
we'll just weaken you a bit more. Why is this the game I chose to do the three hours for? I don't know. Mutiny. Uh. Okay, we're good. So he's angry. Great. I don't know what that does. So we're going to have to pray it's different. I'm just going to put you in the front for now because, oh no. Oh, it's the Bruce Coon. We already have you, so. I just realized that. Oh, wait, no, you have wrap. Never mind. Okay. Uh, oh. There's a battle. Actually, go behind you like this and grab a chest. What's near? Antidote. That's not going to cure the anger. That is there. Oh, very clever. I have to battle. Yep, yeah, it's time to battle. Okay, you've got a, a snow bat. Okay. Let's go ahead and wrap. That was a good damage. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, swaddle. Jet strike? Okay, why didn't you use that from the start? Now I just lost you. Okay, um... Okay, alright, well, none of these skills are effective, so let's go ahead and, uh, Pull off some attacks and see what they do. Headbest. Oh! Okay, well there goes that snow bat. Moss. Oh, I thought it was just gonna be actual moss. Oh, well this isn't doing much. Alright. Claw swipe! Claw swipe! Claw swipe! Claw swipe! Four times. Oh, it's the... Okay. Alright then, let's just keep going. One. Two. Crap! You're... What does curse do? Okay. All right, bring out the Borbo as we peck the boss. And it's gone. And the Borbo's evolving, which I think we know what it is. I think it's... Yeah, it's that bird we fought earlier. The Borbeck. Wants to learn Jet Strike. Okay. The user... Oh, okay. Oh, the move is certain to strike for... Okay, so it's... That's interesting. Uh, I gotta get rid of Hide. Because... Yeah. Now we have a second attacking move on the Borbeck. Yeah, I've got something from here. Fluffy skin shackled beast. 
Okay, well, I'll just claim these rewards then. So, a battle pass. This game has a battle pass, and it's also got a, one of these passes. Okay. Um, I'm going to try and avoid using that. As much as possible. Uh, should be able to be... Never mind, there's enough about it. You know what? I'm going to go back. Aqua Gel? Ah, uh, that's an interesting move. I'll give it a try. Okay, I am back here. I just went to go heal. With the cut ahead method. So we're going to just go ahead and... Because, yeah, I knew this train was going to be a battler. Okay, the beauty. So what do you have? A riffraff. Oh, great. What? Huh, so that's a threat. Okay, the ability. Okay. Ooh. Okay, well, I'm gonna just keep trying you. Use pickpocket. And goodbye. Okay, so what do you have? A, a Clyde Skunk. Okay, that is creepy. Uh, but we could Dark Slash it. Do it again. Oh, great. Poison. Okay, well, I'll just do this again, and, uh, good night. Get out of here. Okay. Vorbeck is now leveled up. You're leveled up. You're leveled up. You're leveled up. Wants to learn Protect. Hmm. I might just get rid of, rid of, you know, yeah, I'll get rid of the squeak. Wait, why would this thing squeak anyway? Okay. Okay, so we got a poison. Uh, well, since I just mold. Oh. Guess a year old poison. Attributed one. Uh, it started raining acids. Diseased? Um... Not good. I was gonna get rid of the poison. Now we've got diseased. Uh-oh. Great! Status effect, I can't heal. Wait, why am I giving it? No. Use. Okay. Oh, boy. Um. I'm gonna just swap you over for the four back. As we have another battle. A lot of battling here. Why did it start raining all of a sudden? I don't know. Why is there so many battles in this game? Okay, we got... Crap. That's that rock thing. Uh, rugged. Oh, great. Definitely not good. Uh... Okay. But sadly, this is all I could do that's an attack. Uh, 
Okay, well, and uh, there goes Warbeck. Great. Uh, well, let's send out this thing that I got from the lottery, and I do a water bolt. Oh! Well, that worked. Oh, it's probably because it's rain. Oh, great. Okay, thank goodness for the multi-hit, because that means just take it out. It's probably because it's raining. That's what did the more damage than usual. At least I think it did. That's the reason. Okay, uh... Alright. You leveled up. You leveled up. Wants to learn protect. How many of these things have I got that want to learn protect? I'm going to get rid of... Harden. Definitely get rid of Harden. Okay. Go up here. Oh, it's the Webin' A thing. Okay, so... Huh. I want to avoid... Okay, here's what I'm going to do. Hang on, no. no, don't give... There we go. Okay, so here's an idea. I'm going to walk around these two by going through the grass. Okay, we're in the new area, thank goodness. <laughs> and it only took me an hour and a half. Oh well, I'll try to record this game for this, for this three hour thing. Okay. Uh, can you two please move out of the way? No can do, buckaroo. Sheriff Craig says no outsiders. Well, it's raining. Yeah. No, we're here to fix the rain. This rain isn't natural, it's caused by the closest key guardian. What's a key guardian? Sounds like an outsider to me. Yeah. Seems like these two won't budge without a... No! Get ready to... No! Oh, Jesus, what just happened? I just blinked, I was about to say, don't! Wait! Don't engage them, outsiders! That's what they want. I just blinked for five seconds! I was about to go, no! Blinked and was like, wait, what just happened? I just heard a sound. <laughs> and no one disappeared. Oh, okay. Phew, that was close. If you battled them, Craig would declare you two delinquents and ban you from town. Why is Cassidy, the mayor's daughter, protecting outsiders? Are you a traitor? Well, for one, you know the mayor doesn't support this certain policy of kicking outsiders out. Out, outsiders. We were literally sent by a Duco executive to fix this rain problem. All we need is information so we can find the key guardian, and then we will be out of your hair. We promise. <laughs> You're lucky you have the goody two shoes on your side. Your corrupted father won't be the mayor for long, Cassidy. Watch out, Sheriff Craig is coming for him. Yeah. Sarah, why are you even here? Whatever. Whatever. Let's pack it up. This town is a complete opposite of Lakewood. Wow. Graphite Lodge wasn't always this hostile. My father is the mayor of this town, and he's honestly trying his best. It's tradition for the mayor to select a sheriff, and my father chose Craig. Obviously, Craig wasn't always like this. The first few years, this town grew exponentially under his, under their leadership. What happened? Ever since a month ago, the time the Doodle Co. Key Hunt competition started, Craig enti Craig's entire demeanor changed. He's just evil now. I don't know what exactly happened. All I know is that if Craig 
if Craig is left to his own devices, he will become mayor and ruin his and ruin his town forever. This is a cool story and all, but we're not here to solve your town's political problems. We could do that at the same time. I literally spent two hours battling someone to save a kidnapped person only for it to be a waste of my time. Let's make a deal then. I know you're looking for the Key Guardian. We are. We're both a part of the Duco Key Card Hunt. Good. We could come to an understanding. I know the general location of the Key Guardian. He's in this town. We'll find him without your help. No, he lives in the forest maze close by. <laughs> hey, mazes! <laughs> However, due to circumstances, outsiders can't visit the forest maze. Oh. <sighs> Fine, I get what you're saying. We'll help you get rid of Craig for access to the ma forest maze. Uh, glad we can come in on an agreement. My house is the closest one nearby, the one with the blue roof. Craig has gotten support of the other villagers. He may have spies listening to us. Come meet me in my house when you're ready. This isn't going to be simple. I hope this isn't a recurring thing. I'll see you at Cassie's house. I think it is, because I know for a fact I've played many games that have that reoccurring thing. Okay, so I guess there's one more of those things left. So, I don't know which one is the house, but I think I need to go visit the... Never mind, let's go visit Cassidy first. I just went into the wrong building. <laughs> He's finally here, come over here. These outsiders are TJ and me. They promised to help us with Craig. And here is the mayor of Graphite Lodge. Oh no, it's the old, okay. Hello TJ, and yes, I'm grateful that you two are here. Good thinking on recruiting outsiders, Cassidy. The townspeople love Craig. They would never let it help, never help me. Just so, just to make sure we will get access to the forest maze after we help you, right? Oh, I went right. Of course, I never go back on my word. F the first issue we have to solve, the town's perception of outsiders. We won't be able to get rid of Craig if he has the town on his side. Perhaps if these two do some help center requests, the town will start to think maybe outsiders aren't half bad? That's a good idea. We shall have these outsiders do a help request. Man, I have a bad feeling about this. You want to get access to the maze, TJ? Well, that's the only way. <laughs> Cassidy can show... Can you show them how to help... How the help center works? Mm-hmm. Meet me at the help center. You shouldn't miss it. That's the building I tried entering first, but I made a mistake. I've heard about help centers before. I tried to get Duelco to build one to Lakewood a while back, but they were very against it. It's a similar story here. Cassidy went to Duelco and asked them to build a help center. The Duelco rep blew a gasket and tried to convince her that help centers are useless. I don't bow down to Duelco, so I had to help center build here anyway. <laughs> of course. Cool, I guess I'll get going. Time to go to the help center. Also, well, I think this is going to continuously bug me until I click it, but I'm going to click it once I have a late rewards because I don't normally do this. Well, I mean, depending on the game. Okay, so here's the help center. See this bulletin board? Imagine this as a a screen and click or tap it to open up the help requests. There's only two re help requests available right now. TJ, you'll do this help request. Bro, are you serious? The request says, I was doing some farm work when I lost my precious sewing needle. Please find it for me. <laughs> Good luck, because I think it's in a haystack if I know my logic. Ugh, sounds tedious, but this is for the key. When we're both done with our tasks, let's meet up in the mayor's house. See ya. Now it's your turn. Let's open up the quest board. Uh, this is the quest board. There is only one quest available, so click or tap it. Uh, okay. These are the job details. You can only take one job at a time, so remember that. Now accept this quest. 
Okay, so what does this say? I need someone's help. The town's bully, Carson, took my lunch money. Please meet me in front of the help center for details. Okay. Okay, a request from Alice. It says she's in front of the help center, so I... Yeah, okay. Then once we're finished... Okay, so she's gonna go prepare something. Okay. Let's go help out! Oh, you're right here. Are you the one who took my request? Thank Lewis. <laughs> the town's bull bully, Carson, has made me his target for the past week. Recently, he stole some of my money and even one of my doodles, my poor snowbat. I want you to help me confront Carson. He and his friends like to hang out behind the doodle center. I'll meet you there. Okay, well... Something tells me that he's gonna force that snowbat to battle. So there's only one thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put the... Oh, I could've just dragged this. Okay. I'm gonna put my strongest doodle in front in case it's that situation. I came around the opposite side. Hey, look, guys, it's Alice. Have you come to give us the rest of your money? Carson, um, I'm here to take back what you stole from me. <laughs> Is my hearing broken, or does she think she has a chance against us? Well, that's the funniest joke I've heard in quite a while. Wait, guys, look. Oh, that's the outsider ta the town has been talking about. Really, Alice? Seeking an outsider's help to settle your problem? Maybe I ought to steal the last doodle you have. Okay. I'm too weak, and I don't want to risk losing my doodle partner. Please. You have to deal with them. The outsider is looking for a fight. Carson, leave this pipsqueak to me. Very well. I'll entrust this to the two of you. Pete and I have perfected our teamwork. Let's fight. Okay, here we go. Let's pool against Ben and Pete. I saw one, and it's a... <laughs> um, it's a double battle. Well, I didn't expect that. I didn't think this was in the game. Okay, um, right. Well, I don't want to deal with the moss, so I'm going to just go ahead and... Oh. Let's go ahead and uh, I will swap you out for the, the Warbeak. I can use War Bolts. Boom. Okay. Oh, they both have Water Bolt. Okay, that's interesting to know. Uh, oh, I can actually do that. That's better. And then Jet Strike the Boss. Leaf sap on. Oh. Uh. Okay. Alright, well, let's get rid of that mutt fish and I'm a jet strike the moss again. Bye! There goes the moss. I was not expecting this to be a double battle. Okay. And then the rest of the party. War ball. Ultimate. Oh, you live with your health. Okay. All right. There goes the fish. <laughs> or the muttish. It's a tish. It's a, a muttish. Okay. Weird name. All right. What do we have? Uh, a tadapole. What the heck? Sweet aroma. Right, Laura. Oh. Okay, and a little bulb. bulb. Oh, wait, that thing. Uh, oh! If we can do that. And... I might swap out the Borbeck. Well, actually, no. You're neutral damage, so... Well, gang up on the little bulb! Oh, crit! Dark Slash! Knockout. Okay, but oh, unsweet rolled up. Fast food. What? What? What is this? 
Fast foods! This move is certain to strike first. I get it. Because you're a bunny food-based one. Okay, uh, I think we might just get rid of sweet aroma. Oh, wait, no, what am I thinking? I need to drag drop it. All right, we'll do that. Okay. Forgot sweet aroma for that. All right. The weapon A is leveled up. Rust. Did nothing. I guess it's water-based. Okay, well, we'll just have you do Electrify, and we'll just Jet Strike the... The Tatapore. Electrify! Bullet Corn! Well, okay. Alright, uh... Well... Go Rosecoon! Or Roscoon. So let's see, nibble- NIBBLE HIM! <laughs> Never mind! <laughs> okay, there goes the ball. Pole. Okay. Alright, nibble, there was nothing there. Holy Lewis, you did it! You defeated Carson's friends. Oof, we should retreat. Let's wait, meet up with Carson, he'll know what to do. Agreed. Where is our backup hangout spot again? Isn't it near the Route 4 gate? Bro, Alice and the Outsiders are literally right there. Oops. It's time to confront Carson. Thankfully, Pete isn't very smart, so we know where Carson is. I'll see you near Route 4 gate. Oh, great. Make sure to heal up. It's time to end this. So I've got to walk all the way back there. Alright. Give me back my snow back, Carson. You, outsider, how did you, how does it feel to be a follower? I wouldn't know. <laughs> Don't listen to him. You are strong, I'll give you that. Unfortunately, I am stronger. You will see why people in this town fear me. Are you sure about that? Because we'll see how you go with you, you hooligan. Carson, alright, what do we have? Your first up is... I freaking knew it! You did send out the snow bat! I knew you were gonna do that! Get that! Oh, great, you lived. Okay, the Tempest does absolutely nothing! Except that now it's clear skies. Get on board. Alright, what's next? Wiglet! Oh yeah, the pig. <laughs> okay, uh, we'll just go ahead and just spam the file on the pig. Electrify, headbutt, and I'm just going to electrify you one more time, goodbye, that's two down, two to go. And, <laughs> what? Ago Toad, what, what, that thing looks weird, it looks like a weird, I don't know. But I've got a strange feeling that it's going to take out uh, Benga looks, so I'm going to just taser you. Get you paralyzed. Okay, you did that. Uh, electrify. It's a fire thing. And now I'm burned. Great. I had a feeling that was going to be the case. Uh... Electrify everything. Oh, there's the burn. Okay. Uh, well, I'll just electrify one more time. No crit. I was hoping for a crit. Oh, there's the crit, but I got hit by it instead. Okay. Alright, well, since you're a fire toad, I'm gonna use the buoyant seal, because... I've got water! Goodbye. Alright. Rose Coon leveled up. Okay. Rough fire. Oh, it's the dog. Okay. Well, I know what to do. Wait! That's not very effective. Wait, I just realized... I just realized something. I have this. 
if you've got fire attacks... <laughs> Wait, no. Okay. Well, oh, pfft. well, never mind. Okay, so maybe the steal from the roulette was actually a blessing in disguise. By complete accident. Okay. I lost. Give me back my snowman, Carson. I can't believe you used them in battle. Yeah, guess you can have it back. Don't let it phase you. The outsider just got lucky. You're right. Yeah, you're right. Thanks, Pete. This isn't settled yet, Outsider. I know you're in the key hunting competition. I'll get my revenge on you one day. That was ominous. Anyway, let's go back to the help center. Thank you so much for your help. I'll be honest, I was kind of weary of Outsiders, but you've shown me that you aren't, that they aren't half bad, all bad. I'm also dissatisfied with how weak I am. So I've decided that I'm going to enter the Doodle Co. Battle Leagues. I'll for crying out loud, how many of you are joining these? When we meet again, I'll be a strong tamer. Goodbye. You completed the help request, big bully. Okay, so we got to talk to the receptionist. Which I'll do just that. Okay. You completed the quest, big bully. You've earned 3,500 cash for completing that test. You also got... The tally counter. Alice provided instructions on how to chain doodles. Oh! Uh, fainting the same wild doodle over and over again causes a ton of benefits. This is called chaining. These include increased misperate chances, chance, increased hidden trait chance, and increased skin chance. The chain will reset if you capture any doodle or faint a doodle that you aren't currently chaining. This tally counter item lets you keep track of your current chain. Oh, and there's more. You also got the doodle scanner. The doodle scanner lets you encounter doodles without you moving. Just use it in the area, in an area where you can find wild doodles. Completing this request opens up more help center tasks. Have a nice day. <coughs> Welcome back. Oh, yeah. Welcome back. Here's your friend. Is he still doing his help center request? Anyhow, anyway, you should do more help center requests. We have no time. Hello, Cassidy. We're still waiting on the other outsider to finish his task. We can't wait for TJ. Craig is finally making his move. What? What is he doing this time? He's trying to capture Mel Zuri, the doodle which protected our town for hundreds of years. Uh, this is very urgent. If Craig captures Melzuri, he won't even need the town's support anymore to replace me as mayor. Cassidy and I are too weak to deal with Craig ourselves. We need your help. If you can stop Craig... If you can stop Craig here, I'll allow you into Graphite Forest, where the key guardian Nimbus lives. Nimbus? Okay. Craig is trying to capture a male Zuri in the Crystal Cavern. To get to the Crystal Cavern, you must first go through the crossroad gate, which is north of here. Okay, me... Alright, so we gotta go to... <sighs> so he's trying to capture male Zuri, which I think is a legendary doodle, if I'm guessing correctly for how powerful it sounds. I think what I might actually do before we do go set out to stop him is I think what I might go and get some more capsules. So I'll see you guys when we get into the crossroads. I may have gone overboard with the, the capsules. Okay, so we've got to get through here. Okay, well, I know for a fact I can evade all these battles. I just go behind you. This guy... Okay, well, I can't... Oh, wait, that's Cassidy, isn't she? Yeah, okay. You're here! Craig's in the Crystal Cavern, probably plotting his town... This town's... Okay, I'll see you inside. Alright. Time to enter the Crystal Cavern. 